I am Ra. I speak to you today for New Earth's Next Step 777. As a part of the Earth's ascension process, her core frequency has begun to expand through the portals and she is calling you to return to this vibration. As the core frequency of the Earth is beginning a new expansion and the energy of the new Earth is beginning to arrive, billions of people are tuning in today for the global live Earth event to raise awareness and trigger a movement to fight climate change. The Gateway of 777 is a transformational gateway where we are collecting collectively beginning the shift from an ego-centered consciousness to an earth-centered consciousness. All the energy work that came before prepared the way for this next step. The seed of this shift is now being planted as people everywhere are thinking about the earth and about all the other people in the world who are thinking about the earth. We are now beginning the movement and transformation into the new earth, where this earth-centered consciousness is fully realized. The best thing we can all do to support this shift is to call in and welcome joylessly the energies of the new earth, and then practice honoring the physical earth and her transformation. Ask to be taken down into the core to merge more deeply with the core frequency of the earth and practice focusing down through the base chakra and feet chakras. There is more earth frequency available to you now because of recent changes and we are being supported to really embody core earth frequency again. This is the key to our ascension. We must become filled with this frequency and hold it for others to step in. I am Ra. You are aware that your world at this time is in the ascension process. This you know. You also know that you and each individual person at this time who is in awareness of and open to the ascension process are doing clearings on self for there is the awareness that you cannot bring old programs with you your body needs to be a clear vessel please be aware dear ones that you are experiencing all part of the reunification and ascension process that you are in the midst of as you tap into the higher levels of consciousness, you must also be aware that the lower portions of your brain or the sections which resonate to the lower frequencies of the third, fourth dimensions and contain your animal, human, instinctual nature are gradually being modified or shut down. Your instinctual nature is slowly being replaced by your intuitive nature as you tap into the wisdom of your sacred mind and gain the ability to interact with your higher self and your guides and angelic helpers. We've often spoken of the light packets of wisdom stored within your higher brain structure and we wish to emphasize once more that all your vast history, your lineage and your divine heritage are stored within the treasure chest of your higher sacred mind. I am Ra. Know that it is time now, more than ever, to live your lives in integrity that has been true to yourselves and your missions on earth. Step outside of yourselves Bring your compassion and love to everything that you do. You are right now, shifting from the old ways to the new ways of expressing on this beautiful planet. You are, are at your side as you go through your days. 
you are not alone. Now the earth at this time is also doing her own clearings. You are aware of this. This awareness does not bring you down to the frequency of fear. It brings you to the awareness that you can do something to assist the earth in making her ascension a more peaceful one by anchoring the light and staying in a higher vibrational frequency yourself. So do not be dismayed if your past is becoming only a hazy memory, especially the painful memories you experienced during this lifetime. It is time to heal and release the past, dear ones. It is no longer serves you to delve into past lifetimes in order to heal yourself or to try to understand why you are acting or reacting a certain way in the present. That is the old way. The distortions of consciousness you created in the past cannot exist when you fill yourselves to overflowing by the processes we have taught you. These magical particles contain the pure, perfect essence of the Creator and will gradually transform, transmute any distortions in your auric field and your physical vessel. Slowly but surely, imperfections you have created both in your inner and outer worlds are being rectified. As you eliminate old habits, beliefs and actions, you gradually return to harmony within the accepted spectrum of polarity or duality with each high frequency level you attain. You leave behind those situations, people and things that no longer are compatible with your new level of awareness and resonance. It often seems as if you step through a new dimensional doorway and a po portion of the past is fading away. That is why many of you are experiencing the loss of friends and or family members and why you are changing jobs or beginning a new career. Many of you are also moving to a new place, sometimes not really understanding why you have been guided to a certain area. But there is a deep inner knowing that it was meant to be. Many of you are finding that the work you do your recreation your pursuits, hobbies, and many things that inter interested you in the past are less satisfying, for they do not fit into your ever-expanding, evolving reality. The multi-dimensional doorways of the past are closing, and the doorway of the future are opening at a faster and faster pace as a process of ascension accelerates. The fear of change has been a major controlling factor within your conscious awareness for a very long time. In the beginning of your journey into density you sought a greater variety of self-expression and change and you delighted in each new creation. It has only been during your earthly experiences that you have forgotten that you were a co-creator endowed with a full measure of creative abilities and that you have a direct link to the power source of creation by the river of life and light. I am Ra. There is a shaft of golden light extending from the circle to the heavens. And as you stand here, request that all negative belief systems that you hold be brought to light. It may come as a thought, a vision, a feeling, a sound. Release them into the column of light. It is here that you request alignment to the higher light and vibrations of the fifth dimension and higher. We leave you on the ray of golden light. We support you in this process at all times and guide with our knowledge. 
Dearest souls, what a gift this is. For the first time, you, humanity, as human angels, are privileged to co-create with spirit. What you choose and what you create at this time will lay the foundations for the new cycle and the new earth. So we cannot stress enough. Now is the time to choose life, love, peace, joy and beauty. Now is the moment to affirm who you are and to create from that essence. The earth awaits your choices. You are the creators. We in the higher realms are here to support your choices and your creations. We rejoice when we see the positive and loving choices that you are making in your work as co-creators of the new earth. So in this month of July, as you enter into the new energies, we see many of you guided to certain places and rituals of love. Many have chosen July as the time to honor the energies of 777 and the opening of the new stargates in the Earth's galactic reconnection process. Others have chosen 17th of July, which I know has just has gone in, in fact, but the energies are still around. It's a global reconnection as they have been led by the inner guidance. But July is still going on and I also know that my, my partner, Rosalie, of a beautiful uh, human, uh, sort of a, what they have arranged, the fire, the grid is yet to, to uh, be done. And I think that is a beautiful, really process that is going to be happening where you all gather. And I think that is a really noble, gracious uh, thing to do. So I think, yes, very good, very well done. So we ask you to honor these moments and this process as a preparation for powerful energies, renewal that will pour through the Lion's Gate in late, in early August. So I am Ra, creating in perfect balance and through sacred union. Dearest ones, you honored the divine mem feminine and the energies of the triple goddess in July and into August. The divine feminine comes forward to meet her divine counterpart, the divine masculine, to create the perfect fire or sacred flame known as the twin flame. This is signified in the skies of your world by sacred union of the two energies at the Heliac rising of Sirius, where Sirius represents the energies of Isis, the Great Mother, and the Sun represents the male energy of Osiris. In their sacred union is the perfect balance of passion and creativity to co-create with spirit. And as you move into the sun sign of Leo, the goddess manifests as a fire goddess passionate, warm, sensual, the perfect forge for the ultimate transformation of co cosmogenous. So dearest light workers, the energies will be intense, electric, passionate, turbulent, creative. So stay in your center of light and peace and stay calm and serene walk your path with grace and dignity and unconditional love i am ra 
dearest ones, the new day is here. We wish you well as you create the new earth, for this is your destiny, and it is time to awaken and to express who you are, for you are children of the stars. You are the divine essence in human form. You are powerful creation. You are, now is the time. Bless you, bless you, bless you. Well done. Thank you for being here and listening to me tonight. And yes, blessings go with you. Be well and create well. Thank you. Namaste. And namaste from me too. From Rosalie. Thank you for being here tonight. Namaste. Love you all.